Is your party ready? I hope it is. Hey, hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Now, I've got to work my way back over to the Makuhita Dojo and I do believe things have changed since the last time we were there. So, I think I'm going to take this walk without any sorts of cutscenes. Oh yeah, I got to do that. Uh, I'll be able to I'll be able to do that when I uh get some of the Makuhita, um, but basically there's a Curlia behind that door. Did I get a Curlia before? I don't remember if I did. Well, I guess we'll see. Maybe. Maybe. But anyway. Yeah, this is the place that I'm looking for here. I just want to sneak my way through here without, oh, without getting super sonic because there is ugh, a rather tedious section coming up and I'd like to clear out my party as best I can for it. So I'm going to start out by using the Swellow on the weird mushroom that we've seen a long time ago. And sure enough, it's a Parasect! You probably would have guessed that very easily if you know your Pokémon designs. So I'm going to capture this and... Hopefully. <laughs> oh, poopers. Yeah, almost. Almost. Careful. Careful. There we go. <laughs> Woo! There we go. Now, there you go. We got it. No funny dialogue. It's sad. It's sad. Wait, wait, Paris. Don't, don't touch. No touchies. No touchies. Okay. <laughs> now, I want to get as many as my party will allow me to here. Oh, I was going to release a bunch of Pokemon in my party, but whatever, whatever. I am okay with attempting this because I'll be able to re release Pokemon after anyway. Ah, so close. So close. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Come on now. Come on now. Mm. Work with me. <laughs> Maybe I should just do a discharge or I should do it the more patient way. Mm. Oh, poopers, I touched him. Mm. Mm. <laughs> like the more patient way is getting the cursor out and away from the Machamp. Ah. Ah, fine, I'll do a discharge. <laughs> I'm burning a lot of time that I could be using for the biggest, baddest Pokemon in this cave. <laughs> there we go. Machamp gets. What's the point of getting this Machamp? Well, you'll see. But anyway, I'm going to be releasing you and you. Yes. Sorry, guys. I need the room. I need the room. <laughs> All right. Now, I'm going to have to capture... Two more bad boys of smashiness. Uh, okay, I just want you to do your hammer armor or whatever the heck it is. <laughs> Actually, yeah, I think it's arm thrust. Mm, there we go. That was good timing. I, I mean, it was just dashing into my line just as I was about to pull off of it. Alright, one more, and you'll see what I'm going to be doing with all of this very shortly here. I just want to get them separate so they don't like... You know, get together and team up on me. Hey, hey, come on. Over here. Over here. Thank you. Because <laughs> both of them, I mean, two at once, a little bit on the awkward side. Oh. Okay, I just got to anger the Hariyama a little bit. <sighs> this is the tedious part, or I should say a part of the tedious part that I was talking about. Because uh, you must get... Your team as filled as you possibly can to be, able, to be able to do this in as few moves as possible, I guess you can say, to try and make it as quick as possible. And by try, I mean it's not going to go that quick. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh, I almost ran into it. So yeah, you might have seen this post over here before. Well, now I'm going to cross over that with the ivy sword that I got from the forest. Remember, remember, I was planning ahead. Well, that's where it starts. <laughs> and now here comes the tedium. You get pooped out over here. Now this, see, you can't go back over to the Makuhita Dojo or anything easy without another Vine Whipper. And this is this will lead you back to the start, which you don't really want to do. So instead, we're going to go and clear out our party here. First, we're going to start by using the Scyther. Remember, I got another one there back at the other the forest, the area, the deep part of the forest, last part. And that's why I got that. There you go. And now over here, yeah, it's one of these sorts of rock falls. 
And we're gonna use a Machamp to clear it out. Take that! Yeah! Machamp is a lot more efficient at clearing those out than Hariyama, I gotta say, in terms of the animation. Now, over here in this corner is a lone and rare Dug Trio, the only one you'll find in the cave. Oh, I gotta dig it in with it. Well, whatever. So, but I gotta get that Dug Trio. Uh, preferably without the Diglet interfering. Oh, I went under underground. I just wanna do two quick circles. There we go. <laughs> I could do this all day long. There's no way you can avoid my circles. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Oh, I thought I had it there, so I released it. Oh man. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> so it just keeps pop- oh, it, keep it keeps popping in and out of the ground. And since- oh, why did I let go? And since it's a ground type, uh, your discharge will not work on it, and I'm not gonna use any of the Poke Assists that I have, because seriously, I don't want to go back and get more Pokémon. <laughs> so, I'm gonna do this until I get it. And you're gonna like it. Yeah! <laughs> why? Just why would you do this to me? Mm, no, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and you know, I oh, I just realized something. I haven't really explored uh, Fall City post game, have I? You know, to see what they have to say, like I did the other city places. So yeah, I, sh I should probably do that at the end of this part, just for the sake of showing everything. So this is, <laughs> I think you see where the tedium is coming from in this. Oh, oh, oh yes. So that means you gotta do the loop. And you, uh, to get more of the fighting types that have three smashy smashies, you know, Makuhita or uh, Bachamp, and we're gonna try and do this in as few moves as possible, hopefully. And, uh, I think I'm just gonna clear out the Doug Trio and Diglett after this. And, yeah, I think that is for the best. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry, guys. But yeah, I got these two extra Vine Whippers here, you know, to cross gaps. Because I need to do that loop again, and, and after these boulders, there's actually another Vine Whip gap. So you need a very specific set of Pokémon to get through this whole thing. And it's it's kind of annoying if you don't, because you have to keep bouncing in and out, and yeah, so that's why it took a bunch of planning to pull this off. And it looks like it's all going according to plan nicely. Come on over here. Away from the Machamp, thank you. <laughs> Alright, do your thing. There we go. And, 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 you're gonna do more? Of course you're gonna do more. Got anything else? Oh, no, you're not. Alright. I'm gonna start circling! Ah! GG. GG. <laughs> I don't remember how many of these I need, though, to actually get through that boulder tunnel, but I think I need six at least. <laughs> so, I'm gonna get all of them. Mm! Wow, that works a whole lot better than it did the other time. That's nice, though. Alright. Going back to do the loop. I like those two lines on the ground like it's a sumo wrestling type match place. It's pretty clever little detailing. I just wanted to anger it a little bit and then touch it to let it go. There we go. Ah, victory is mine. I really hope I don't need more than six of these. <laughs> Because I've already used three. One to get into the Doug Trio area, two to start making my way through that corridor. And come on. <laughs> Seems like it, ah most of the time it does two. You know, two of those arm thrust things. Uh, oh, oh, I touched it. Mm, mm, mm. Why is this last one Gary me so much higher? I don't know. I don't know, but I got it. <laughs> Alright, now that you've got a full team, plus two Pokémon to cross gaps again, we are going to do the biggest, oh shoot, the biggest, baddest Pokémon in this cave, and these two are not it. <laughs> so I'm gonna carefully get myself through here while saving my Styler's energy. And there we go. 
All right, are you ready? Are you ready? Well, there's still more tedium to go. <laughs> so now that this is clear, uh, mm, mm, now that this is cleared out, and I've got one vine whipper left. Oh, I guess I didn't need that many more. Okay, well, whatever. That's all right. Tis okay. <laughs> Better safe than sorry, because you do not. And I repeat, do not want to come back through here more times than you need to. And oh, 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 there we go. I will do that. And anyway, the po the two other fighting Pokemon will actually come in handy for the big bad Pokemon of the cave anyway, so eh, eh it's fine. <laughs> Anything that gives me double the looping power is a friend of mine. Now, there we go. I can cross this gap. That's a pretty treacherous gap, I gotta say. <laughs> Now it looks like we're trapped here, right? Nah, we're okay. There's a tangle over here. I'll just I'll just grab it here now. Because I'll need it to get back after all. Uh, so let's so two circles for the win. And look at that door. Did you see that door before you got in the battle of this? Now that's that's something special here. Let's go in and see what's beyond it. It's it's automatic doors, apparently, even though they're rock. Look at that, it's the legendary Registeel! Yep, that's the big bad Pokemon of the cave. It just kind of hangs around there. By the way, this room is a reference to the rooms of the Regis in the Ruby Sapphire Emerald games. They're, the rooms had the similar rock designs uh, around their rooms. Yes, yes. Anyway, it's boss time! Was it worth it? Was it worth it? Maybe. Maybe, because it drops marbles down from the heavens, and it's got a crap load of <laughs> just, just so much health. And this is where the fighting Pokemon may or may not come in handy, we'll see. It is possible to do, just by oh, just by some skillful circling and, av and avoiding the marbles. And I know they're not marbles, but <laughs> they're more like big metal boulders of doom. Yeah, I didn't think so, it was crisscrossing over. Mm, I was just hoping that he was gonna go back the other way. Mm, come on now, boulders. <laughs> Fine, I'll use the poke assists. Are you happy? Are you happy? Just speed up, speed things along. Hopefully. Oh yeah, those. That's right. Those lightning things actually hurt. Your Styler, victory! <laughs> Woo! And there we go. Oh yeah! It also has its own smashy move. So maybe that's how it sealed itself in there to begin with or something. I don't know. I don't know. Now, with the power of Tangela, we can flip-flop our way back out and head over to Fall City to check out some other stuff that we haven't fully explored. Like, you've seen all the, you know, all the dialogue back at, uh, uh the Ranger Base and Professor Hastings' lab, but... Have we went over to other locations? I don't believe we have, so why not? <laughs> I'll see you back over at Fall City, I suppose. Hoppity hop hop up. I made it! And guess what? Guess what we're finally gonna see? My Styler is not full in energy. Guess what we can do? Guess what we can do? We can finally recharge our Styler in a whole base! Come on, I'll give you the dun 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 oh dun sound like the regular Pokemon games. Can we get it? Oh man, you're not gonna do that sound. I am extremely sad now. But yeah, that's all there is to it. Thank you, thank you. Um, maybe. It didn't seem like... Yeah, it seemed like everything was okay. <laughs> Hopefully, they won't call on the Rangers too much then. Hmm. Yeah, it sounds hopefully, maybe. That would be nice. I'm just I'm just casually walking through here with a Registeel too, and no one's really taking any notice of that. <laughs> just just kinda hanging along here with a legendary, you know. Just casually roaming around. <laughs> Alright, now you've seen basically the well not not all the lower areas, but we've seen the lower left area. So let's head over and go, say, in a counterclockwise direction, shall we? Can I go in? Yes, I can. Of course I can. This is the Skitty House. Yes, 
Roll call! So many skitties. Oh no, oh shoot, no. Oh, I don't see any fights. Uh, yeah, of course there is. Okay, everyone's there. I don't have to catch them all over again. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> That's. Well. Well, I, I don't want to say anything about that. But you seem to have a relationship that. Uh, well, never mind. <laughs> Uh, really? <laughs> okay. See, I'm gonna flip flop around here. This over here was where the capture arena was. I already chatted with everyone there. Um, yeah, it's just pretty nice. Awesomeness, awesomeness. And now, oh, hello, lady. What's up? Can I buy some stuff? I would like some fruits. Ah, uh, maybe not. Sweet. Is that is that alcohol on there? What the heck? <laughs> I didn't click that before, but yeah, th doesn't that look like bottles of alcohol or something? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe it's supposed to be like cooking oils. Hey, did you ever name the fountain? They did? Let's hear it. Let's hear it. Woo! What is it? What is it? Oh, Solana fountain. Oh, that's... What? What the? Ha! Huh? You, you used my name? I am gonna file a copyright infringement on you, and you are gonna get it. You are gonna get it. Anyway, lore area. <laughs> uh, did I peek surrounds here? I mean, uh, yeah, I did talk to peeps during that event, but I didn't really get any sort of dialogue going here. And, you know, there's always a star you hang out in the basement, of course. Mm hmm? Mm hmm? Mm-hmm, I see. I see. Well, basement of lighthouse, not like basement of a building or anything. Well, I guess lighthouse is a building, but or windmill, never mind. <laughs> eh. Oh nice. But I've got a I've got a lapras. Oh jeez. <laughs> oh jeez. <laughs> well, I, oh, I wonder who was. <laughs> it's just you know, it's all just written on the board anyway. And just, you know, ignore the right <laughs> Is that exciting? Oh, I mean, it is that excited. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hmm. Yep, that is true. That is true. All right, I'm out. <laughs> it shouldn't take too much longer to explore the rest of this. Don't worry. You probably already left the video by now if you're bored of this sort of exploring. But I feel that you'd miss out on some fun dialogue if I don't. Oh, nice. Awesomeness, and yeah, I am. I, I guess <laughs> is Lapras doing okay now? What? How can you tell? It just goes brrrr, something like that. Yeah. Uh. uh oh. Okay. <laughs> Do you have something to say? Okay. You did you? Is that Solana? Is it? Maybe. Might be. I'm not sure. Well, whatever. <laughs> I'm heading back up and going along the right side now. And avoiding the ludicolo if I can help it. So just kind of like a little bit of like, eh, I'll just let you pass through. I'm not going to really get into that capture arena dumplings. Yeah, well, I, I guess so. That, that might bring in the sales. <laughs> How's it going there? Oh, no. You mean it actually happened? I wasn't dreaming. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> well. Hopefully they aren't doing anything. Oh, okay. I was gonna say hopefully they aren't doing anything bad now, but they seem to be okay. <laughs> so that's why I like to go through the dialogue, because it gives you a little bit of extra story as to what what things are doing now, post game and whatever. And there's still more story about uh, the baddies coming up, but you know, we, I'll, I'll kind of save that for the very end. End. Oh wait, that's the factory. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna go down that route, but yeah, that's definitely the factory. I cut up there to get the Kecleon. How's it going? Uh, uh, wait a second. You have the same dialogue throughout the entire game? What? What is this? What? Come on now, woman. <laughs> Alright, going up. Got. Are you still fangirling over Joel? I guess so, huh? Uh, uh, you? <laughs> How about the apartments? How about I go start from the top and work my way down? There wouldn't be a skitty on top of the apartments anymore, that's for sure. But maybe there's something else. There is not. 
<laughs> I don't know. I just wanted to see for kicks. I didn't think there was, but I just wanted to see. Alright, uh, apartments. We're going in. Hope that guy is uh, loosened up a little bit. <laughs> uh, yes, yes. Uh, wait, is that the same dialogue? Same. Oh man, you have the same dialogue too. Man, what a ripoff. <laughs> anyway, going back down, and probably wasting more time. It's, it almost seems like the that we're kind of limited in how many new dialogue we're getting here. You two, two, two. Uh, well, I, I guess we could have tea and do a jigsaw puzzle or something one day. Up to you. Up to you, but maybe I'll have to find the day off in my rangering. Oh, but I can make time, I'm sure. I can make time. The Go Rock Squad is out of business. <laughs> and there we go. Last one. Here we go. Remember, all that over to the right is just dead end. Uh, what is it? Uh huh. What is it? Ooh! Uh, well, I guess, but I'm not a- am I- wait, do you think I'm a cute Pokemon? Uh, never mind, never mind. <laughs> Alright, I'm done with the apartments. Let's flop back outside and continue my trek up the right side here. And I guess I'll do a little detour over here. It's kind of- kind of necessary, I would say. Anything in the crevice now? Uh, I guess not. <laughs> <laughs> that would be a really great place to put a skitty in that minigame, you know, searching for skitty around the place, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? Oh, really? Okay, let's we'll see. Whoa! That was uncanny. Wow. That was really impressive, actually. How did you pull that off? You sounded exactly like that. Listen. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Listen. You hear that? Wow, that's incredible. That guy should go on a talent show. He would get first place. All right, what's in here? Two people, that's who. Yeah, sort of, kind of. I'm just kind of collecting Pokemon around here, just kind of shooting the breeze with people, seeing... You're welcome. Seeing what peeps have to say that's new and, you know, maybe exciting. Who knows? Who knows? A lot of the fun in games is the dialogue. Well, not entirely, but... <laughs> You can't can't just get by with just dialogue, but yes, yes. <laughs> eh, sure, why not? Mm, well, I I got him pretty easily. Apparently, you just said the right seven or eight letters. <laughs> uh, anything new about the clock? No, it is not. But it is keeping accurate time, so that's good. That is good. And we're almost done with our little circle here. Oh, oh, um, maybe I shouldn't, uh, I'm gonna leave you. <laughs> uh, wait a second, after I finish the mission, actually, maybe you guys have do have different dialogue. Um, maybe not, maybe not. Anyone in the basement? Remember I lit this place up with a star you? Oh, it's dark again, really? Well, well, best of luck with that. <laughs> Okay, no new dialogue, even with the machines. Sad face, sad face. Mm hmm. I don't think there's anything new in the sewers, though, if I recall correctly. Mm hmm. Oh, well, that does sound pretty awesome, actually. <laughs> that would be like the most comfy bed in the world. Mm, I, 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 I kind of did. I, I, yeah, never mind. <laughs> I mean, I, Solana is another one of those silent protagonists. But yeah, let's check the sewer slash waterworks here, see if there's anyone at least near the entrance or something. I don't believe there is, but there might be, just... Nah, I didn't think so. But you can go back and uh, re-catch other stuff, because... Well, I, I, sh I shouldn't say re-catch other stuff, there's still more for me to do uh, down below. Remember there was that one place that I had to burn something to get through? Well, I'll be catching that Blaziken off-camera, basically, and fluttering down there, or maybe I'll get a fire Pokémon later on some other route. Uh, last guy, I guess. Uh, oh, I see. Well, could I try and capture them and then release them? Because maybe with my newfound Ultra Ranger powers of being able to release Pokémon to anywhere, it'll actually work. Maybe? Eh, well, I guess that's okay. <laughs> Scrimer aren't 
grammar aren't not friendly or anything like that. But anyway, I've done a full 360 around the city. I have captured a legendary Pokemon which no one took any notice of. So I am going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part when I continue my Pokemon collecting spree. Oh, and don't forget, I got the Doug Trio and Parasect too. <laughs>